Good morning, this is Jason from TooTired.com. Uh, today I'm in Chiang Mai, which is the capital of the north of Thailand. If you come to Thailand and you find yourself in the north, there's a pretty good chance that you'll find yourself here in Chiang Mai. Um, it's a great city, there's a lot of history. Behind me here are the gates of the old city, which are still standing. The walls of the city uh, are still here. Um, it's also a really good adventure destination. There's lots of things to do here. If you want to ride an elephant, um, if you want to do that kind of thing, there's lots of that around here. Um, one of the biking challenges that exists is to ride up Doi Sutep, which is a mountain that sits up behind the city. Um, I'll get a view of it a little bit later on. Part way up the mountain is a temple called Wat Doi Sutep, and a lot of the local people here cycle up there uh, in the afternoons and the mornings. Um, today's Tuesday, so I'm not sure if anybody will be riding today, but we'll, uh, we're going to ride up and have a look at the ride. It's up, up, up. It's a pretty hard ride. It's a really good challenge, so uh, we'll see how we go. People seem to have this idea that Chiang Mai is still a small town. It's most certainly not a small town. It's a city. It has peak hour traffic. It's just after seven in the morning here on a Tuesday, and this is what we find. Um, once I get out of town just a little bit, the traffic will ease up, and once I'm on the mountain, there won't be much traffic at all, and it's gonna be a really beautiful ride. So I've ridden seven and a half kilometers to get to this point. I'm just outside the Chiang Mai Zoo, where they have a panda. Um, the panda had a baby last year. Thailand's gone crazy for pandas. They even have a 24-hour panda channel. It's a lot like Big Brother, just a camera fixed on a panda. Pandas don't do much. It's pretty boring. Anyway, I've ridden seven and a half kilometers to this point, and from here, the climb really, really starts. Um, there's been a little, little bit of an incline just for the last kilometer or so. It looks like the mountain's in fog today, so it could be all cool and misty up there, which might, might be nice, actually. So uh, it's time to get tired. The whole way up, you have two lanes. So it's pretty safe. There's not much traffic. Most of it's motorbikes. And uh, when it's a car, they keep over and out of your way. It's pretty good. That's all I can see of the city today from this viewpoint. It's all in cloud, but I'm up in the clear air, so it's still very nice up here. Not all the dogs are scary in Asia. Make friends with them. They're very friendly, aren't you? Found some local cyclists here. Are you yeah. from you from Chiang Mai? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, and you stay here. you come every day? Doi si tep? Every day. Every day. Two times. Two times. Two times. Yeah. Wow. How how many minutes from? Uh, Su Chu Temple. Uh, thirty six. Thirty six minutes. Yeah. Okay. Road bike. Road bike. Uh, mountain bike forty minutes. Okay. And when you go down, you go on the road, or yeah. down the track. To down this track. Ah, okay. This is the trail that those local riders are about to head down. So he said this was an advanced trail. Of course, when you get to the top, it's at its steepest. So, so I've reached Wat Doi Sutep. This is the start of the staircase. There's over 300 steps up to the temple, which is uh, just walk up around to the right and up you go. Um, in this area, there's a big car park. Over the back here, there's a car park, lots of shops. So you don't need to carry lots of water. You can buy water and Gatorade and drinks up here. Now I might look tired, but I'm actually feeling pretty good, so I'm going to keep going and ride up to Pu Ping Palace, the Queen's Palace, see if she's in. Four kilometres. This is starting to feel like the Wizard of Oz where you never reach the end, you never reach the palace. It's been a very long four kilometres. So I made it to Pu Ping Palace, you can see the, the spelling changes get used to that in Thailand. There's no consistency whatsoever. Uh, it's been a 
a hard ride. I'm going to have a little break here. There's plenty of shops just behind the camera. Have a, have a drink and then head back down. The road's pretty wet today, so I'm not going to be going too fast, I think. See you later.